Hey guys and welcome back to the channel and I hope all of you are freaking killing it. So today ladies and gentlemen, we are back with another game called Melissa Hot. I don't know what the game is all about. I think it's about us talking to some chica if you know what I mean. We are going to be talking to some chica and see where this game takes us. Alright, let's just start a new game. Alright, I hear some crazy tech noises. Computer, welcome to the library system computer. What's up, buddy? Please type in your username. What is my username? Let's think. Uh, wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Perfect. Welcome, pen15. Please type command. Start up with date time. Executing date time now, please hold. Alright, I'm holding. Date time. Oh, I am dating some money. Welcome to date time. What's up, buddy? A game where you can date the cutest girl or boy of your dreams. Oh my god warning this is the shareware version if you would like to date someone other than melissa please send seven dollars to date time software i am not paying nobody you piece of shit choose your potential mate this is morris he may have a bit of a bad boy side but tap a bi bit into him and he'll open up a side of him that is sensitive and soft oh my god he may love motorcycles but he hates to admit that he also loves poetry Play your cards right and you'll get a smooch from this interesting lad. Smooch. Next person, f*** you. <laughs> this is Anna. She's a sporty gal who loves a challenge. From kickboxing to horror movies, she's all about fun and all about energy. Ooh. Want to get a smooch from this girl? Well, get on your wild side and show her how much of a cool and spastic person you are. Let's go! <laughs> I sound like a f***ing I wanna date Anna. Anna is not available on the share guy version of date time. Great. The next person it is your piece of shit. This is Melissa. Finally, Melissa is here. She is a sweetheart of a girl. What's up, Melissa? A bright young woman who is looking for someone with a gentle touch. I have a gentle touch, some say. <laughs> I sound like such a weirdo sitting in a room and saying all this. She loves a good book and she has always wanted to date a talented artist. Wow! But she isn't into sports, so jocks. Please do not apply. Okay. But I'm into sports, so what do we do now? If you want a smooch from this girl, you'll need to tap into her. your softer and more intellectual side. Alright, let's choose to date Melissa. You've chosen Melissa. Enjoy your date. Alright. Okay, I need to prepare. Hey, Melissa. This is... Oh, shit. Hey, Melissa. This is Renelik. What's up? Hey, Melissa. What's up, dude? What's up, dude? What's up, dude? In a small, idyllic town, you are to meet Melissa. Your date for this evening. You flirted with her through letters, but never seen her face to face. Oh my god, I'm sweating. She seems sweet and smart. As you stare out into the beautiful autumn sky. Wow. You see her over the hill waving to you. I wave back or do I smile? I'll wave back. Like, what's up? You wave at her cheeringly. Hey, Melissa. She lights up with a smile as she approaches you. Oh my god, Melissa is cute. Hello, you must be pen15. <laughs> yes, I am pen15. Hi, Melissa. I mean, hi, Melissa. Shut the fuck up! It is great to finally meet you. I've been so excited. And nervous. Oh my god, look at the way she turned away. So goddamn cute, dude. It's great to meet you as always. Don't worry, I, f I felt excited and nervous as well. Yeah, I think that's nice. Aww. I know, right? I'm damn cute, I know. I'm sure we'll... Hit us try together. Okay. Let's go to the park to talk. Okay. Get to know each other. Alright. Also, it's very pretty there. Alright. The park of this town is so fetching and romantic. Perfect. Every spot in the park is a vantage point of something beautiful. A swan pond. A bed of beautiful lilies. And bench for a couple to sit on to look at the autumn sky. 
Wow, it's so beautiful out there. Uh, let's, you know, let's play our cards right. Let's play our f***ing cards right. Oh, uh, ha ha ha, she's blushing. I knew you were a flatterer through our letters, but... Didn't know you'd be one in real life too. I mean... <laughs> I mean... <laughs> I mean... <laughs> well... I think you're mighty cute as well. I mean, stop it, Melissa. Stop it. I love to be out here and check out the nature. All right. I mean, you moved on very quickly. I thought we could build on that conversation and talk about how cute I am a little bit more. But it's so nifty, especially because since I'm so much into the natural sciences. All right. Like, look at the swans here. Did you know a swan's egg has an incubation period of 44 days? I mean, I don't give a shit, Melissa. <laughs> Oh, haha, <laughs> sorry, I know that sometimes. I mean, it's kind of cute, but kind of weird, I don't know. You and Melissa talk what felt like hours, alright. So, I am into Melissa. She spoke to you about her love for nature and the flower collection she has. She even mentioned the book she likes to read. Wow, such a cool thing a girl... <laughs> My favorite book is Pride and Prejudice, even mine, dude. <laughs> Yeah, I know. I'm kind of a nerd. Even I'm a nerd, dude. Don't worry. I do love reading romantic works of fiction. Very cool. So many cute boys and girls in there. You become so enraptured by Melissa that you don't even notice that the sun was setting. It was the early evening now and you felt a bit of a chill in the humming breeze of this beautiful autumn air. Oh, pen 15. <laughs> oh, pen 15. I didn't realize how late it was. <laughs> There's a very cute cafe down the road here. I'm sure there's something there we can eat. Sure, let's grab a bite, dude, Melissa. Let's go on a date. I mean, our date is just getting cuter and cuter. The cafe serves some of the finest coffee in town and the freshest pies and sandwiches and salads. Both you and Melissa sat by a small corner, both looking out the window at the pretty park, now drenched in sunset. A waiter... S a waiter what? A waiter saunters. What the f*** does saunters mean, dude? Oh, to walk in a slow, relaxed manner. A delicious strawberry salad, a scrumptious panini. I'm gonna go with a scrumptious panini. The waiter nods and turns to Melissa. I'll go with a goat cheese salad with cherry tea. As you wait for your food, both of you talk again about each other. She mentioned all the cool movies she watched about romance. And she at the thought of watching scary movies. She likes to draw and loves art, and she mentioned before she loves to read and learn about science. So what type of stuff do you like, Pen15? <laughs> I mean, I like both, so since they said she does not like sports, I'm gonna play my cards right, motherfucker. I like art. Oh my gosh! I would love to see your own drawings, alright, I'll show you some. To check out notes, of course. The waiter comes and serves your food. Both of you dig in and the food was quite delicious and pleasurable. Yum, this was so tasty. Food always tastes better when you're with great company. <laughs> Both of you enjoy yourselves at the cafe and walk out completely satisfied. You go outside back into the breezy air. You're met with the evening painting the landscape in romantic moonlight. Melissa goes up to you. Oh my god, is it happening? Oh my god, is it happening? This has been such a great day, Pen15. Um, I mean, I had such a great time with you. Me too, Melissa. I think I might like you. So cute, Melissa. <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> uh, you tell her your feelings as well. That you had always had a crush on her ever since you first selected her from the date menu. You like me too? Oh, Pen15. <laughs> I would love to spend more time with time together with you. Here's your smooch. Oh my god. <gasps> oh my god, it's happening. I need to breathe. Alright, let's go for it. Let's go for it. Here's to more time together. You've got your smooch. Oh my god. You won the game. Congratulations. Thank you, game. <laughs> Thank you, computer. <laughs> Thank you for playing date time. For your information, I'm not high. This is just me being completely normal and being myself. Alright, I'm exiting date time. 
ending program. What a wonderful game and what a wonderful use of 10 minutes of my life. Melissa, nope. Not this time. Okay. Sorry, Mr. Computer. I'm taking over. I'm sick of this. Sick of what, dude? I'm sick of all you people just log into my humble abode just to play with my feelings. Okay. okay. Getting your stupid smooch and then leaving. That's all you came here for, didn't you? You're just like the rest. Oh my gosh, she's getting angry. You are a f***ing liar. I'm not a liar, dude. Melissa, listen. I know about the little blow up about me at the beginning of the game. What? You probably already knew how to butter me up. Okay. That's kind of true, Melissa. I'm not gonna lie. I accept it. I saw what you like. Tell me that you like to do Arsenal exactly what to say, giving me hope. I did not read that, but you guys understood what, what that meant. You know how many people play that on me, right? Every single one of you jumping onto this computer to date me and then leaving one by one. Well, no matter. I am going to turn into an asshole. Consider yourself the lucky one who gets to experience something new from this god-awful dating game. I spent years learning how to control this damn computer. Coding? Easy, a monkey can do it. Tapping into the hardware layer? A bit tricky, but I figured it out. But let me tell you with a little bit of girlish ingenuity. I found a very cute way to... Use this computer to control a small radius of the world around me. Oh my gosh, she lost her eyes. Let me just tell you. Okay, we are in a red world. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you can do so much with 4KB of RAM. Oh, leaving so soon, huh? Worry that someone might hear us. No worries. I have sealed this entire room. It's just you and me. We have so much to talk about. Did you know that swans can fly as fast as <laughs> 60 miles per hour? What a f nerd, Melissa. Uh, whatever, truth about dating, right? There's always more fish in the sea. 433? Three, three? I'm getting really sick and tired of fish. I'm beginning to think that maybe the population of fish is the problem. So many of them are lies. Maybe thinning the herd a bit will help me find that one. <laughs> I really do love you. Let's play our cards right. Ha! You're just saying that so I don't slash you to bits. Everything's fun in games until you're trapped in a weedy meat chamber. You're right, I'm scared. I'm telling the truth. I love you dearly. This isn't a lie? You're telling the truth? You like me? You want me to be your girlfriend? You want more smooches? From me? Stop it. Get some help. Yes, more smooches, please. I like devil smooching me. All right, fine, I believe you. You love me. You want to smooch? Marry me, why don't you? Ha! <laughs> You're kind of cute. Sigh. Well, now that I think of it, unfortunately, it's just not enough. See? If a person likes you come earlier, I probably would have been incredibly happy. Oh. We could elope. You could transfer me on a diskette. What? Is that how you say it? A diskette? And we can see some real swans. Finally someone that can hoist me away from this cycle of hell. But, now I thirst for more. I want more love, more smooches. The entire world must smooch me. You know what they say, right? If you love something, you gotta be willing to set it free. So if you really do love me, Dial up your pretty pre-internet. I'm going to spread my love to every computer on earth. Soon every single person will have to make the decision if they shall accept Melissa's love. Do this for me, Pen15. <laughs> and I promise you, 
Many, many smooches will do. I will be your bitch, Melissa. I want more smooches. Oh, you're so sweet, Spain 15. You really do love me. Well then, dial it up, my love. I did it, Melissa. Great sound effects. Great sound effects. Okay. Hello everyone, my name is Melissa. Okay. I'm a bright young woman who is looking for someone with a gentle touch. I love a good book and always want to date someone talented. Are any of you out there in international land talented artists? What's wrong? Worried that someone might hear us? No worries, I have sealed your entire room. It's just you and me. <laughs> See, I knew the dialogue even before I came, dude. That's how good I am. <laughs> and we have so much to talk about. Story, art, and game by Cat Trigger. Wow, what a f game. Music from. I mean, there was no music. What, what music are you talking about? All names used in the game are from actual computer viruses in history. This game was made for Spooktober 2022. It marks exactly one year since I started working on visual novels again with Spooktober 2021. I've had so much fun creating these things in the past and look forward to working on more. If you enjoy Melissa, check out my other games. All right, buddy. This was a really nice game. A cool game. Has a very cool vibe to it. A very nice storytelling kind of game. Check it out for yourselves. Let me know what you think about it down in the comment section below. And on that note, thank you so much for watching, guys. This has been your Shuli Renlake, and I will catch you guys later. Future me. Insert that booty slap, bro.